So at those stage now where frontline social critics, uh, Comrade Patrick Eholo says government at all levels have failed in its corporate responsibilities towards assuring the safety of citizens over the spread of COVID-19 pandemic. Comrade Eholo, who is the founder and president of One Love Foundation, believes that with the untold hardship brought about by the sit-at-home directive, government would have done more to ease the stress undergone by its citizenry. Eholo made the statement while speaking with Plus TV Africa's Akwome Jero Friday recently in Benin City. The uh, area of you giving a uh, uh, security vote to governors, the area is going to be over now because we don't have money. What we depend on was oil. Oh, yeah. So this is going to force us now to go back to farming, to go back to back what we used to do, to go back to the granite pyramid, to go back to, you know, we're doing maize, uh, doing cassava, exporting organic food to abroad. So it's only the strong that will survive the time we are. And I know as Nigerians, we are good people. We are strong people. If Nigeria has the courage now to slash this or some of these disgruntled honorables, they are not honorable, some of them. They don't deserve that name honorable because most of them are very disgruntled. They don't do anything. Why do we pay people a lot of salaries so they don't do anything? Why are you slashing the ordinary people's salary when they don't do anything? However, he condemned the action of government in the distribution of relief items. If the government said they had uh, uh, reached out to people uh, through political measures, how many of those can you confirm? Which area? What, was it done along party line or was it done for every citizen of Edo State? I am from this area. I have not seen anything. But I also know that I've been to IDP camp. We've not seen them there. I want to go give them some, uh, some food and some other uh, things to help them. I also went to my village at uh, Ovia Northeast to assist them. And I'm not saying they're not doing anything at all, but uh, when they are talking about figure, you know that something's already wrong. I mean, look at what happened with the uh, uh, federal level, where they claim that over 100 billion was spent in three days. I mean, come on, how did they do that? And then look at how fire got the place because of fraud, so that what we're going to turn into a explain to audit for us, then there's no documentation to show.